Looks like they're just taking a couple of seconds to make sure everything on the course is all ready for him. Lights flashing, and Sean is on the move. In seasons five, six, and seven, we had the over the ledge skill event, which was a very long uh, cliffhanger line that you went down and back on. Sean won that all three years. And something I want to point out as well, as I said, there were three bars ascending in the Lachey lane. Uh, Sean only went up to the second before linking immediately across the way to the trapeze. So we might see a lot of shortcuts being taken here. Very very straight on keeping his hands narrow and together so that way he doesn't have to worry about oh hello didn't see that there oh we've got a sword move designed similar to what uh matt bradley made way back when not too long ago you gotta pop that hook out of its slot and then use that momentum to swing down uh, and so much happened showing so much happened, I didn't even get to go over the fact that we have our first buzzer of the division. Incredible run. Right into Sean Arms, tackling the pole vault. Sean has a strong idea of the competitive field, being late in this, late seated in this competition, taking, wasting no time on skyhooks, and looking to line that up. He has the time pressure there, almost missing that second grab, but he's gonna line up the dismount here. Sean, a two-time strongest ninja. Looking to put that to use here on the course. Well, he definitely is a strong ninja as he moves into Kaleidoscope. And these later ninjas really are making this look incredibly easy, even though it is such a difficult obstacle and such an arm burner. For sure, Moving these ninjas get better the... and better every year. Right and boats. it's always a... Now they're Pulling taking it that back. backwards approach. Yes. Seems to be the, more, the approach now. More and more ninjas starting to take that backwards approach on the second boat as we're seeing the ninjas learn from each other. And that just goes to show you how important finishing high on that placement course is. Yeah. Sean using the platform there to his advantage to build up some momentum as he lines up the first grab. Gets it. No troubles there. Spins is he going to go down. for the static here? No, he's going to go like for the hop. But he gets the hop first today. Pops up. And Sean this Arms be an incredible... is our second finisher. <laughs> and I believe As... a faster time than Nick. We'll have to double check. Oh, absolutely. That was an incredibly consistent run then. Flawless, no mistakes, no problems whatsoever. Sean showing us that he is a two-time strongest ninja and that he is here to play and here to compete. What an absolutely incredible run, Alex. These, these later ninjas are truly just flying through this course with ease. And I think they're learning from a lot of other people's mistakes, but I think the experience and the strength is just showing, showing very clearly now. And what is amazing here is with the second disc is once you land it, it looks fine, it looks static, but it moves so much and it's such a perfect balance that you need to be able to reach but Sean there making easy work of it and having no problems 